Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development. So guys, in this video, I will show you how to display the images in a grid layout in your Android app application. All right. So guys, I will show you the demo. So let me connect my phone and I'll let me open the sightseeing app. All right, guys. So this will be this will be the layout all right so i will have the images which will be which we will be displaying on our grid view so let's get started so first of all what we need to do is first of all let's create a custom uh, resource file so i can say custom image layout okay and let's change it to relative layout and here we can say image view match parent match parent okay or we can say 100 dp and also 100 dp okay and let's change the padding let's set a padding to 10 dp and here okay so now i have the images okay so these are the images which we will be I will copy all that just copy that and paste it in drawable folder okay so let's add a the image view here so we can say drawable one okay so this will be the uh, single row so what now we need is here we need a grid view match parent match parent okay so there will be uh, some properties which we will set so first of all id my grid view one okay and the other thing which we need is the column width and we can set it to 100 dp so we need the number of uh, column so we set it to auto fit so if the if the user has small screen phone so it will adjust okay the columns will be adjusted and also we need the stretch mode to column width all right so our layout is complete now let's go to our main activity and here first of all initialize the uh, grid view so here we can say grid view equals you by id r dot id dot my grid view one okay this was the id i guess yes my grid view one all right so now the next step is let's create a class uh, adapter class so click next java class image adapter okay so now we need a base adapter so we can say extends base adapter and after that we will uh, override the method so first of all get count get item id get item and get view all right so first of all what we can do is here we have we need to initialize all those uh, images in an integer array so what i have done is i have already uh, right so i will just copy that and i will paste it here okay so we have this images id uh, integer array and we are storing one by one in that integer array okay so the next step here is uh, let's create a base uh, the default constructor so we can say base adapt sorry image adapter so we can say context ctx and let's initialize the context here so here we can say this dot ctx equals to ctx all right now what we can do is in our get count method we can return the length so we can say image i images id dot length and in our get item id what we need is
uh, get item id this is a position and in our get item we can say return in this and position all right these three methods are now completed so now the, we have to write the code for get view method so here we first of all let's say we have a view grid view equals to convert view all right so now we will check if the grid view if grid view is null okay so here we can say layout inflated inflated equals to layout in inflated cpx dot service contact dot layout inflator service okay and what we can do here is sorry view equals to inflator dot inflate so first of all we need our dot lay dot custom image layout okay. and let's let me check if i have set the okay so here we can set the id by image okay here the second argument will be the parent and the third will be null okay i guess we don't need the parent okay so now the, it will be null and after that we need to initialize our image view And grid view dot find view by id r dot dot my image all right and simply we can say i1 dot set image resource and here we can say this id and position all right and we will return the grid view object here all right so now the code is complete it's very simple and now go to your main activity and here first of all initialize the adapter so we can say image adapter image adapter to new image adapter and in here pass this and we can now say grid view dot set adapter and in here we have to set image adapter okay save that and let's run our code and let's see if it works or not okay guys so now the uh, you guys can see i have this uh, layout all right so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe